Hi, I'm Angie Monco. I'm a life coach for intuitive women leaders, and I'm also the owner of Harmony Harbor Coaching since 2008. And, you know, I, I'm very grateful that you're watching my video. And what do I do? What do I do to help these women that come to me? They often come to me feeling very stressed out and overwhelmed, stretched thin, because they're on this hamster wheel of feeling like they have to do it all, that they have to be there for everybody else. And they often then sacrifice themselves. You know, they're always the last on the totem pole. And so they get the scraps. And so it's no wonder that they're feeling burnt out and they're ready to do something different. And so I show them a new approach to life and it's using energy. Uh, I'm all about energy techniques. I first started, my first love was emotional freedom technique, also known as tapping. And then I became a certified hypnotist and a certified healing code practitioner. And I also am very well versed in Donna Eden energy medicine techniques. And my latest certification is positive intelligence. So over the last 15 years, these are things that have found me. I wasn't even actively searching to get certified. It, it was just sort of a natural approach to what was going on for me and my coaching business. It just fell in my lap. And, but it's defined me and it's defined how I help women. And it's this energy approach, which I believe is where we're heading as far as mental health and, and emotional health and spiritual health and physical health, holistic health. I believe that's where we're heading for the future because an energy approach is so fast. It's the most advanced. It's the most effective because we get to the core cause of what's causing someone to be always on that hamster wheel, always pushing herself so hard. So just a little bit of uh, about me. I actually have 20 years of experience in corporate America um, in finance, accounting and operations. So I got an accounting degree and I started out in public accounting and I did that for seven years. And then I went into medium and large sized corporate uh, companies like AT&T was the last one where I worked. And, you know, I had the golden handcuffs. Um, I actually got into live coaching because I began going to a 12 step program. I don't know if you're familiar with the first one was AA and then there were offshoots and I went to OA, which is Overeaters Anonymous. And I started, I got a sponsor to help me work these 12 steps. And these 12 steps are meant to help us to renovate our relationship with ourselves, others, and God, or a higher power, however you want to define that. And it's, um, it's kind of like coaching, but I didn't know that at the time. And so a few years after being in program, someone approached me after a meeting and said, hey, have you ever thought about being a life coach? And I thought, oh, what? I had never even heard of it. And so that began a journey. About a year later, I didn't do anything with it, but a year later, someone else said the same thing. And this time I took it seriously. I searched and I looked into life coaching and that led me to emotional freedom technique, which is this technique that helps you to release negative beliefs and feelings and emotions and step into your power. And, and that's, that's, that was my first love. And I, so I started doing that in 2008. I launched my business in 2008 and I absolutely, uh, I loved it. And I loved helping people on this profound, deep core level. And so it took me two and a half years, but I transitioned out of my corporate career of 20 years. And now I've been doing this full time for, well, since 2011, February. Um, and so it's, it's my passion. It's my calling. And, and I would love to support you if you know, or if you are an intuitive woman leader who feels like you want to get off that hamster wheel of overwhelm and stress please reach out to me. The stress will kill us. It'll affect our health. It'll affect our relationships, our career life, and it affects everything. And so the cost of inaction is really high. And there, on the other end of that, there's so much to be gained from really looking in our heart and our energy and figuring out how to align with our true desires know, what really matters to us 
It's everything. And being kind to ourselves and knowing I am enough. So um, thank you so much for watching this video. And um, I appreciate you very much. Take care.